Happening today, Greenville Fire Rescue is changing the way it handles fire safety inspections. WNCT's Jessica Joel joins us now live from Station 1 in Uptown Greenville to explain. Jessica? The fire prevention staff here starts conducting inspections on a company level today. That means when you see fire trucks rolling out of stations like this one, firefighters are not only responding to calls, but they're also being proactive. They're going to businesses you frequent, like churches, childcare facilities, restaurants, to make sure these places are safe for you and your family in case of an emergency. Now, state code mandates these inspections to look out for any potential hazards that could cause a fire or an explosion. Thanks to all the growth and construction we're seeing throughout our city, the demand for these inspections is increasing. In 2015, Greenville's fire prevention staff completed just over 1,800 fire inspections, yet they expect this number to grow to 3,500 in the coming years. Fire Marshal Bryant Bedard said these inspections are important to make sure the businesses you visit are safe. Some of the common problems that are found are uh, problems with their fire extinguishers, um, exit signs, emergency lighting, uh, extension cords, and things like that. Common fire hazards, exits blocked. All 37 fire rescue officers received updated training to fill this growing need before only three people conducted these inspections. Now, the department offers a pre-checklist and a list of common code violations for businesses online. You can find that link on our website at WNCT.com. Live in Greenville, Jessica Jewell, 9 on your side.